My name is Elena Austin, and I am a refugee. When I was two, my mom, my brother, and I, we fled our homeland because of civil war, and we escaped to Ethiopian refugee camps. After years of living in the refugee camps, my mom applied for resettlement in the third country. We were the lucky 1% to get accepted. We were put in a place with other refugees from Ghana or Somalia, Rwanda. Rwandans, they have seen genocides. You can see the pain in what they've been through. In high school, there was a large segregation between refugees and non-refugees. This bothered me because we all came here to learn and we had a lot to learn from each other. People believe that refugees are here to steal their jobs and hurt this country. But the truth is, refugees are here because the only place that they called home became a battlefield. I think that is an important story that refugees should tell and Americans should hear. I took a marketing class known as DECA and wrote a business plan. I called my business New City of Hope because of my mother. When my mother left her homeland, running to their enemy's territory, she wasn't sure if they are going to let them settle. But the only thing she had was hope. My business was created to educate the community about the plight of refugees. I took my business plan, competed in state competition, which I won. There, I heard about the Young Entrepreneurs Academy program. The Young Entrepreneurs Academy program provides funding and connections to start your business. I got $1,700, which was exactly what I asked for. New City of Hope's mission is to bring out the true story behind refugees. Since we have started, we hosted seven seminars and educated over 2,300 students. Now I'm excited to be a freshman at ISU. New City of Hope is growing, and so am I. This wouldn't be possible without the Arizona Lottery support of the Young Entrepreneurs Academy and the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce.